Hi, I am Anna. I come from www.ntvforex.com. Asia update the primary market narrative remains unchanged analysis http ntvforex.com news id 5 bbb 289152022542 am us stocks finished stronger monday nbsp the smp rising 1.3% after a sideways session in europe and gains through asia tech drove the us rebound with the nasdaq rising 1.9% US 10Y Treasury yields rose 1 BP to 0.67%. Oil and gold were little changed. But EDA US equities leading the way again. The positive charge is being attributed to corporate deals with several company announcements in the spotlight, such as SoftBank, Gilead, and Oracle. There have also been more constructive comments on a possible COVID-19 vaccine from Pfizer. The primary market narrative has not changed a cyclical recovery over the next year, driven by a gradual return to work. NBSP however, sitting on top and king of the super short-term momentum trade has turned into the proverbial tail wagging the dog. NBSP the mega cap tech stocks have ample reason to cope with the virus well, if not reach outright supremacy. But this moment has created an all-powerful and self-activating force that continues to attract well-established quant funds and day traders alike. NBSP still, EDA s not the choppy seas but the undercurrent that pulls you into the rocks. NBSP and with a growing divergence between buoyant markets and still tepid economics, those are the undercurrents that could always present the biggest challenge to the view. However, the risk on move has had little impact on fixed incomes. Supply is not such a factor this week, and with both the Fed and the Bank of England meeting this week, investors are likely to adopt a cautious approach in the run-up to the meetings. Focus on the FOMC NBSP unless there are a surprise at the FOMC, I don't think this week's Fed meeting will matter much to financial markets. The next important catalyst is probably the vaccine results in late September or early October. NBSP but it could still be a massive week for the dollar and risk in general as the Fed uses a second opportunity to explain precisely what flexible average inflation targeting means. NBSP currently, traders are still a tad confused by the absence of exact 8 parameters post Jackson Hole. We all understand what the 8 means for the future the Fed will stay lower for longer when the unemployment rate falls and they want to hike rates until actual inflation has been above 2% for a while. This shift from proactive to reactive is well understood, but what does this mean for policy today NBSP will they need to immediately become more accommodative to stoke the inflationary fires and get the core PCE above 2% as soon as possible or is the framework only meaningful down the road NBSP the twin fates of the USD and gold are inextricably intertwined these days, so as price action confluences around $1950.60. Whichever way the market breaks should be a strong signal for dollar. Direction after the FOMC. NBSP end of Abenomics as expected, Yoshihide Suga was voted in as ruler of Japan's Liberal Democratic Party yesterday, leaving it almost inevitable that he will be voted in as PM in a vote in the Diet on Wednesday. The focus will now turn to a snap election as prospects to help the new PM secure a popular mandate. Speculation is rampant that might happen as soon as October. With the Benamikes officially over, the USD is dipping again but not yet breaking down completely. Still, multi-year levels sit near. NBSP while a Benamikes was not much of a thing anymore, your first reaction might be to say the resignation does not matter much AEDA's not bullish as JP, and we know that for sure. The architect of the move from 75 to 125 is no longer in power and that has to at least increase the left tail risk a bit for us JP. Brexit NBSP tensions within the UK Conservative Party over the PMS internal market bill NBSP continue to fester. There will likely be no clarity on Brexit well into November or even December, suggested by the latest sharp deterioration in the tone of negotiations. NBSP but with a still reasonably healthy GBP and investor view that political brinkmanship is part and parcel to the UK strategy to ultimately get a deal, this has limited last week's sterling drop. NBSP yesterday you looked far too rich, hence bust too low as I expect the Tory rebellion will likely fizzle out. But that's a guess, 
not a fact see September 14 market open note NBSP so what as the timeline now Brexit negotiations have not been formally suspended, though it is hard to see much of anything getting done when the chief negotiators are engaged in foul-tempered Twitter exchanges. Forex NBSP as equities go, so does the dollar as the currency market remains mainly tethered to risk sentiment vagaries. But it is notable that E-minis bounced off the 55-day moving average again on Friday and now rally. Similarly, USDN quietly made new cycle lows, which has broader implications for the dollar. NBSP indeed, the yuan is providing a more definite read on the US dollar sentiment this week. On the continent, ECB chief economist Philip Lane has been talking a lot, all of it old and not relevant for currency. Of more likely importance is the dark cloud hanging over the Brexit negotiations, which likely hampers significant topside euro progress for now. China has never hidden its intention to boost the UNS status on the international stage and that its Belt and Road Initiative NBSP was a key mechanism. As one official put it in this article for the South China Morning Post, the yuan accounted for about 2% of global reserves and 1.76% of cross-border payments by the end of Junia. It's not commensurate with our country's status as the world's largest foreign trade country. Everyone is running with the assumption that the World Government Bond Index WGBI would make CGBs part of all the primary government bond indices by 2021, likely extending the recent trend of accelerating foreign debt inflows into 2021 boosting near-term CNH sentiment. Well, if that doesn't a T happen, any postponement would be a setback. NBSP however, I still don't a T think it would be a major one. China's economic recovery post-pandemic will be buttressed by consumption, investment and the export rebound, suggesting the yuan will be more than able to bounce back from any mild WGBI disappointment. Markets seem to care little about the process of gradual economic disengagement between the US and China, deferring to the argument that China can stand up on its own two feet. NBSP The monthly China data dump could go a long way to confirming the UNS market bullish read. NBSP after substantial gains as the mere healthy beta to the yuan makes it even more attractive than just its yield advantage versus the US dollar, I would expect some pause on the bullish proceeding ahead of the FOMC meeting on Wednesday. But with the stronger yuan foretelling a weaker US dollar, I would expect gains to pick up post FOMC once the risk has been cleared. NBSP life after the gold rush NBSP gold needs the Fed to make a credible promise to act irresponsibly and aggressively drive inflation expectations higher. Amid all the excitement about the Fed's new average inflation targeting regime, the market remains in a world of confusion as to what it means for today. Perhaps we might be less confused after Wednesday. The Feds could show higher for gold if they decided that stoking inflation is an immediate concern but they could just as soon send gold lower if they choose that slow and smooth is the way to shift from stabilization to accommodation. Subscribe our channel to receive the news as soon as possible. Thank you for watching. If you want to read real-time news, text messages to MT5 Expert Advisors page at httpsm.me mt5.expert.advisors.